Hey guys, welcome back to some more XCOM, Enemy Unknown. Uh, there is one thing I actually am going to do. I realize now that I don't have a whole lot of power left. And I don't have a whole lot of f funds. I need to actually start, um... Uh, I just need to sell something. Uh, probably just a couple of sectoid corpses. Oh shit, I have a lot of Thin Man corpses. Fuck. Well, whatever. We'll do that. Okay. Uh... We're gonna go and excavate this just because we really need the extra power place and like I'm looking at my uh Yeah, like I, I gotta get that underway because I'm gonna need power for the next month to power up some of my uh Things here. So, okay, it's uh, we we have our UFO landing site mission. Contact so detected. This is a bit different from uh, oh look Dan is the Black Widow. Nice I think I whoops. No, 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 no where, where do you go? Get over here. We need to customize him. He needs black hair now. Oh well. No, no, no. I didn't mean to change the hair color. <laughs> this is actually the customization screen. He's a black widow, so he has to have black hair. Just makes sense. Or maybe just like all black armor. Uh, how, how's that sound? See? You can make it black. I think I just missed it. Nah, it's not black at all. I, I, I like how this is important to me. I think they have like a black pretty early on. Yeah, it's customized. Okay, there you go. Good enough. Black Widow. Probably something more helmet-ish. And bald. You could be bald. There you go. That, that looks pretty Black Widow-ish. It had to happen. Alright, well, so we got uh, SGT Dan as our Black Widow sniper. Uh, Volkov, Zero, Sniper, uh, Triple Strike is unfortunately going to have to come with us with the med kit. Uh, who has the med kit? Okay, he does. We need another support. There's no question about that. This guy has to level up. I'm not as concerned right now because the last mission I think was supposedly a lot harder. It looks kind of... I don't know why they... There you go. Giant yellow armor. Nice. There you go. Now this guy's blue. This actually looks pretty sick, I'll be honest. I can't customize Zang, unfortunately. So we have a assault, a heavy sniper, sniper support. That's a that's a team that's worthwhile. Okay, off to the UFO landing site. Touching down. Listen up. We're going to be dropping you deep in the Nigerian interior for the next operation. Reports indicate the UFO is set down in a sparsely populated area. We need to stay sharp and eliminate the invaders. So, um, these missions are kind of interesting. Basically, it's the same as the UFO crash ones, except there's more enemies since it didn't actually crash. Uh, so it, it can be considered to be a little bit harder, uh, than, than those ones. But, uh... I, I'm, I have a feeling that we're gonna. Whoa, whoa! I, fucking that guy's shotgun face. HQ, this is Big Sky. We are in position and awaiting further orders. Roger that, Big Sky. Strike one, you are green to deploy. Approach with extreme caution. Current enemy status at the site is unknown. All right. Well, let's uh, start coming up the rear here. Uh, here we. Here's our sniper number one. That was risque. Uh, wow, we're right beside the UFO. That's some crazy shit. Alright, let's see what's uh, on this side, shall we? Just make sure we don't have any nasty surprises down there. I think we're gonna be okay. Alright. Uh, unfortunately, this person... that uh, the, the hunker down key kind of randomly disappears. It's really weird, but luckily I can still do this, and then you have an intern key as well, so that's all right. Um, it's it's fine that she doesn't have to hunker her down. It's, I would have done that otherwise. <laughs> Holy shit! Oh wow! What the fuck? <laughs> oh. 
No. 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 <laughs> Just no. Fuck all of that. No. This is not how we start this fucking round. Bad game. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, that was horrifying. Luckily they all clumped up really nice for me. Here we go, 30% over there and 50% here. Let's try and get this guy. Oh, we got his cover a little bit. Holy shit. 65. We're going to try and get that sectoid in the back there. Nope, that was a miss. Uh, let's see who, who we got here. Uh, I'm not liking these odds. So let's kill this guy. Holy shit, man. That was just... I had a fucking heart attack there, okay? <laughs> I'm like, this is how it ends. <laughs> uh, you know, I'm kind of feeling inclined to go try and grenade this guy. Uh, not gonna work out that way. Okay, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna run a gun. Change my mind. Because this counts now as a flank shot. Apparently nobody's able to hunker down. And we got him. Wow! That was way too much fun. Uh, oh man. You know, I, I don't think I don't think any moment for the rest of this let's play is just it's gonna top that. Just like I wasn't even I didn't even trigger them. They just all fucking came out at once. They just they decided they hated like human beings and just like, well, it's it's done. Alright. Uh this person's gonna go right here. And we're gonna move up there slightly. Wait, 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 what? You have... Oh, it's... He has a shot right now. It's like 26, so it's not a very good shot. Alright, and you can just... I don't want to really move up here. So he'll just stand in overwatch. And this guy will hunker. So if he decides to come out here, he's probably going to get fucked by my entire squad here. Yeah, we know. We know what's here. I guess he decided to just fuck off now. Uh, it's good with that. Uh, not a whole lot of great cover here. Mostly because I just blew it the fuck up. I can dash into there because this guy has a, de a running gun ability, which could work. It's really gonna be, it's all gonna be on him. That's the thing. Uh, I'm gonna slowly move people up here. Do some overwatches. There we go. And this guy, he doesn't get any penalties, so chances are he'll probably get this. Good stuff. That's what we that's what we like to see. Not fucking ten million people just triggering an Overwatch. It's just, just no. Never do that to me again, game. <laughs> All right, let's see. Well, let's start moving everyone up here. Uh, and these two will Overwatch. Oh, man. Uh, you never really want that to happen to you, especially on uh, Iron Man difficulty. Because, uh, you know, just what am I going to do? Oh, shit, maybe I just won't move there because if I'm going to load up a save. No, that doesn't really work that way. Hey, look who it is. Well, we're having none of that. 
So we use running gun. We can use our second turn basically to come right beside him. Hey. We nailed it, Commander. Mission accomplished. I would definitely say we nailed it. Uh, did that guy get a level? Really hope my medic uh, killed someone. That may not have been the case. I probably I probably should have uh, done that, but I, I immediately panicked when I triggered the swarm. So. Impressed with the results so far, especially considering the conditions down there. Yeah, so am I. Okay, so he's now got will to survive. I don't get an option for this. It uh, it reduces all normal damage taken by two in cover if not flanked. That's really good. And so I either get the sampling shot or battle scanner with my second sniper. And I'm maybe inclined to get disabling shot because the thing is I already have one with battle scanner and having two with battle scanner I don't think is as much of a help as having one with disabling shot because you know it'll help in because I'm gonna get to the point where I'm gonna tr start trying to capture shit so like in fact I don't even know why I wasn't building the the containment prior the thingy but I need more power so we forget to wait until the power comes back on we haven't paid the power bills and look we got a workshop for the first time Nice. Okay. Well, we'll just carry on. Uh, my satellites are about to come online. Commander, our satellite is prepped and standing by for launch. We are ready to deploy it on your orders. Okay, and we have a nav computer. Excellent. I like nav computers. We have a satellite nexus available for construction, which I want to actually build if I can. Um, if I can't, then I don't know. Uh, we can also get some heavy lasers or perhaps a fusion lance. That fusion lance I won't be against necessarily because this is like, um, it's something I c can equip on my my guys, but it requires a lot of resources. Or I could do this and start getting a foundry. Foundry would be actually probably a good idea. Okay, and our council report is coming up soon. But you know, it, I wouldn't be totally surprised if, uh, actually, is, uh, how long for the excavation? The Arrive this oh, morning, not very much. Okay. Two, one. Okay, good. It's still excavating. Are you fucking kidding? Okay, so let's see. Where are we going to launch our satellites? Japan and South Africa are an absolute must, or else I will lose them. Satellite launched. Satellite launched. I have to start making. I have to make some uh, interceptors in Asia. Uh, okay. Now, my next one, I have one left, and so I can pretty much put it anywhere. So, you know, getting it in the, for one of the ones that's kind of in the red would be kind of nice. Uh, I was thinking China, actually, because China's all a part of the same, the same European thing right here. Uh, although, if I do this, um, um, now I already own South Africa, so that doesn't even work. I was thinking of getting this, I'm like, oh, I'll complete South Africa and get the 30% bonus I already get. Yeah! No, we're gonna do Asia, because I'll get another engineer, and China gives me a uh, hundred bucks. The only other option is uh, Russia, and the only reason I wouldn't do Russia is because I'd have to build two interceptors for there. We've been picking up some odd transmissions lately. Some nut calling himself Commander Straker has been all over the news ranting about shadow operatives. I think that's a reference to something, but I simply don't know. Okay, so so China China gets them, and Asia now gets two interceptors. Uh, I said Asia gets two interceptors, which I want to build right now. We don't need this many corpses. Uh, and hey Asia, oh, actually, no, you know what? No, I, don't, I, I can wait till the end of the month. Excavation incoming. of the XCOM project thus far, Commander. Your recent results were beyond our expectations, and that is not a statement this council makes lightly. Yay. All right. Remember, we will be watching. So let's have a look here. Okay, so satellite uplink will take 20 engineers. Okay, no, no, we, we want a nexus, if, if at all possible, and we can do it. We just need power. And how long is a power generator going to take to build? 
five days. 31. Yeah, okay, we can do a satellite nexus. We'll be okay. Um, okay, so we need we need to make two ships in Asia just for defense. So we're making some interceptors. And now we need to really seriously Oh man, how much power does this make? Six. Okay, so it's gonna make it's gonna make a couple of bit of power. I I maybe should consider actually going to the next floor. Like I can make maybe like a um a power thing here, even though I'm not gonna use it, because uh, this is gonna be for the last saddle ex nexus. Because this is not enough power to power. So I need to get this alien containment, which is five. Damn, man. Yeah, I gotta make another one. We gotta do two, even though because I don't get the adjacency bonus, but I'm not gonna keep this one. It sucks, I know, but I have to. Because I need, I, I won't be able to get to the second floor otherwise. It's it sucks the layout I got. It's it's kind of a problem. Okay, I can't do any of this. A laser, actually, you know, laser pistol. Look at this. It's like six bucks. Fuck it, I'll buy it. Uh, oh, satellites, satellites, satellites. Okay. How many satellites will be, be will, will we be able to make? Okay. Uh, the thing is, I need the 300 bucks, 300 space bucks to do it. So I can make four satellites plus one. So I can make five. Question is, do I actually want five? Commander, our current satellite uplink <laughs> facilities are at full capacity. Sure, why not? We should build additional uplinks as soon as possible to allow for new satellite deployments. Because I could sell, I could sell a lot of stuff in order to like look. I have like a ton of corpses here. Yeah, and I got Illyrium. Well, I don't want to sell Illyrium, but if I have to, I will. There. See, 90 bucks. Now I, now I got 325 credits again. Okay, and we got research done, so now we can make a foundry and a finger cannon. Um, trust me, we'll, we'll, get, we'll get more money. Alright, uh, UFO power source, maybe... Uh... I know there's a bunch of autopsies here, but trust me. Trust me, I'll wait. Uh, I guess I could do, like, precision lasers and heavy lasers and shit like that. I don't know, I'm kind of, like, weirded out by this. I appreciate your efforts to support the research team, Commander. Oh, uh, yeah, I appreciate it, too. Satellite coverage, Satellite coverage now. At this point, a foundry would certainly help us further hone the effectiveness of these new weapons and equipment. I'd recommend we get started on construction sooner, rather than later. Alien containment costs 85. I really want that, though. <laughs> Man. Uh, let's go sell more fucking corpses. I mean, eight is enough, come on. Oops. Now let's keep the move. Let's keep at least five of each. I need eighty-five. So, uh, fuck. What should I get rid of? I just need to come on a little bit more. No, oh, I feel like that's a bad idea. I, even though I'll kill some more in the next couple missions. Just need. I need to. You know what? Now, yeah, we'll wait. Well, oh, thing is, if I wait, then I. I I need to get that arc thrower stuff. Fuck. I'll sell one UFO computer, okay? You're gonna hate me for this. Actually, well, maybe... Maybe a power source instead. Because we're not actually using this shit right now. We, we got we got a lot of these things, okay? I'll sell one, okay? Don't worry. Just one. Don't get mad at me. Okay, alien containment. Priority. You know, the other problem is some somewhere in the middle of this month, I'm gonna need like probably like two more workshops because this thing requires 40 engineers and I have like 28. And judging by satellite uplink facilities at maximum capacity, additional uplink required. I'm gonna get like two engineers per month, so like plus two here, and like I'm gonna get three in total from this one. So I need like I think I need like two more workshops. Well, no, maybe maybe just one workshop will work actually because these give like. Uh, these give like five and five and no, oh, okay. I'm gonna need two. Fuck, fuck, fuck me. Well, uh, there's not much I can do on that, so 
And we got some abductions. We picked up multiple requests for assistance. Abductions in progress are marked on the hollow globe. Hey, it's where I live. You know, these these engineers are looking really good. Uh, but we'll, 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 uh, well, let's see. Let's see. We got South Africa. Satellite uplink facilities at maximum capacity. Additional uplink required. Uh, yeah, I'm just gonna go to South Africa because yeah, even though these guys will raise in panic, I'm gonna get five fucking satellites at the end of the month. Okay, do you guys know how big the number five is? I can assure you it's really big. So Brazil, Brazil, here we come for next time. Until then, we will be watching. <laughs>